Un carissimo saluto a tutti e tutte. Ovviamente ricordo che attraverso il preziosissimo indice alfabetico a cui accedete attraverso il sito www.tinelli.eu trovate la voce Flat Earth Society, gruppo di opposizione controllata, che risale ancora al 20 ottobre 2016. I signori che vediamo di seguito dicono cose inaudite che qualsiasi ricercatore vero della terra piana sa che sono menzogne. Dovrebbe farvi capire quanto sono ignoranti sui contenuti che espongono, esattamente come fanno i mainstream italiani quando mostrano le immagini sui loro baucometri. Trovate anche baucometro sempre su indice alfabetico. Buone cose a chiunque. If I say that the world is round and someone else says it's flat, that's worth reporting. But you might also want to report on a bunch of scientific evidence that seems to support the notion that the world is round. I'm open to all sorts of new ideas, maybe better ideas, to make sure that we deal with climate change in a way that promotes jobs and growth. Nobody has a monopoly on what is a very hard problem, but I don't have much patience for anyone who denies that this challenge is real. We don't have time for a meeting of the Flat Earth Society. They dismiss solar power. They make jokes about biofuels. They were against raising fuel standards. I guess they like gas guzzlers. They think that's good for our future. We're trying to move towards the future. They, they want to be stuck in the past. And we've heard this kind of thinking before. Let me tell you something. If some of these folks were around when Columbus set sail, They, 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 they must have been founding members of, of the Flat Earth Society. They, they would not have believed that the world was round. But we have people who still deny this. Uh, members of the Flat Earth Society who seem to believe that, uh, you know, who seem to believe that the ocean rise won't be a problem because the water will just spill over the edge. Uh, this is, uh, it's insane, it's insulting. Now I know there are still a few who insist that climate change is one big hoax, even a political conspiracy. My friends, these people are so out of touch with science that they believe rising sea levels don't matter because in their view the extra water is just going to spill out over the sides of a flat earth. They're wrong, obviously. For the benefit of those who may still question the 97% of peer-reviewed studies on climate change, let me just underscore. You don't need to be a scientist to know that the earth is round.